Yeah. Everything here is so jacked up in price. Holy sh! I got stuck in Istanbul airport for 10 hours, so of course, I had to try the American fast food chains on this God. part of the world. You see it? The golden arches. Let's go! First up, we had McDonald's. They had your typical kiosk, but they had some pretty cool options. What? What is this? There were onion rings and crinkle cut fry options, which completely blew my mind. Their sauces were pretty normal, honestly, but their drinks were pretty cool. They had some Turkish drinks alongside Coke and just Sprite. I regret not choosing more fun options, but honestly, I was incredibly motion sick after my 10 hour flight, and I just needed some freedom food in my body. Big Mac, all right. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, the onion rings hit. I love onion rings. You can't fuck up onion rings even if you tried. The burger was just a Big Mac, but honestly it was pretty anemic. It had your standard three pieces of bread, two pieces of patty, and some lettuce, cheese, toppings, nothing really special. It honestly tasted pretty similar to what I've had at home, so my mind wasn't really blown. It's a Big Mac. I was too sick to give much commentary or to speak. I was fighting for my life in this clip here. I had to vomit like the entire time I was recording and trying to eat this Big Mac was really not doing me any favors. At some point I had literally Googled how to avoid airplane sickness and the top result said not to eat greasy foods. So I really was not doing myself any favors here. And the price was so ridiculously high for McDonald's. This shit was $22 for a Big Mac? Oh my god, it's it's actually Joseph Biden over, dude. Overall, McDonald's was okay. I'd give it a 2 out of 5. Other than the heinous price tag, it was honestly pretty similar to America. I didn't try the fries, though. That would definitely make or break how close it was to American McDonald's. Next up is Popeye's Chicken. I don't know what the fuck a Popeye's was doing there, but as soon as I saw it, I knew I had to try it. Found the Freedom Corner. That's Popeye's, that's Subway, that's McDonald's. Uh-oh. The Freedom. The Carl's Jr. My meal came with a chicken sandwich, a Sprite again, some fries, and a bowl of gravy. Alright, now narrator Jerry's gonna go away a bit more because I got like four hours of sleep in a random chair in the airport, so I was feeling a lot better, so I actually started talking more. Colorado ketchup. Colorado mayonnaise. Popeye's Louisiana kitchen. The chicken sandwich was actually pretty decent and had a good portion as well. Putting the gravy on it made it taste pretty damn good. The fries were also pretty good and I definitely got a decent amount of them as well. The dude was baiting everyone into buying gravy, but he wasn't baiting people into buying biscuits. He would give us like a dichotomy of like, something something gravy or no. I was like, no, I don't, I don't want extra. And he's like, what? And I was like, okay, fine. And then I just see like plus 200 lira on the screen. I'd be like, you motherfucker. <laughs> you absolute motherfucker. Chicken with the gravy. Funnily enough, the best part of this meal is probably the gravy that I got scammed into buying. It was kind of funny to be honest. I don't know if you can see this, but I found a hair in my sandwich. That's crazy. Even putting American Popeye's customer service to shame. Can't believe it. All right, overall, I rate this Popeye's a solid like five. The gravy kind of saved it, but the fries without the gravy, kind of whatever, at least are hot. But the sandwich is pretty mid. The fries are okay. And it's just Sprite. Sprite, Sprite. This thing 
was advertised as like $15 on the menu. And you can see them just adding, just adding shit onto my, onto my order. Like the drink is like, what? The drink costs money and the mega potatoes? I think he just gave me extra. So like, this is what it's originally listed as. And then he just starts adding shit. And then he adds like a salt 300 extra beer onto that. Can't believe it. The audacity, the audacity. It was honestly pretty good, but the cashier definitely kept trying to scam me into buying some extra stuff that was not on the menu. And the menu just straight up lied about how much things costed. So even though it was just a regular Popeye's meal, it still cost me over like $25 for this. Pretty insane if you ask me.